The Oscars are this Sunday, so there is still a little time to catch some of the nominated movies. Dalton Ross, assistant managing editor at Entertainment Weekly, is here with some of the films that are already out on DVD. Good morning, Dalton. Good morning, Maggie. So you brought them with you. Let's talk about some of the smaller ones that people may not have sure. seen. Sure. The Visitor. Visitor, Richard Jenkins, great character actor, best known as sort of the ghost dad on Six Feet Under, but no one really knows him that well. Sometimes a great character actor gets a great role of a lifetime. That's this. Now he, He's nominated for Best Actor. Best Actor stands about as good a chance of winning as I do, probably. <laughs> oh. But going against Sean Penn and Mickey Rourke. But still, it's a great role. There's a lot of affection for him. Who knows? Good movie. You liked it? Great movie. Okay, what's Frozen River about? Uh, Frozen River is a really powerful movie. Not a good date film. Not a good date film. It's a, Why is that? It's kind of depressing. It's oh. about a woman, a single mother, trying to make ends meet. She ends up smuggling some immigrants over the line at the border. And it's... It's tough. It's a raw performance from Melissa Leo, who was nominated for Best Actress. It's a great role, but, uh, you know, a little tough tough to take at times. Okay, so good thing uh, we didn't see it on Valentine's That's Day. That's right. Like. So let, we could lighten it up with Tropic Thunder, though, certainly. Great movie. I love yeah, it. Yeah, great movie. And, you know, Robert Downey Jr., very risky role. I mean, imagine an actor, someone coming up to you saying, I want you to be in blackface and go for laughs the entire time. You know, you have to be a little insane, but sometimes a little insanity is good for greatness. And it's a, it's a great hysterical role. And, and it got him a Best Supporting Actor Best nod. Supporting Actor nod. But you think that's going to go to Heath Ledger in The Dark Knight. Heath Ledger in The Dark Knight is the lock of the evening. And Obviously, The Dark Knight's a movie I'm assuming everyone at this point has seen. Everyone should see. Yeah, but you know, it's the type of movie you can see again and again because you I mean, that performance, he's always doing something new. And lastly, Wally. I've passed it a bunch of times on On Demand and I haven't seen it and yet. And I'm upset at you for this, Maggie. We've really? talked about this. You need to see this film. Okay. It, there's the be it's nominated for Best Animated Feature, a category that if it didn't exist, Wally perhaps could have gotten a Best Picture nom. Really? Yeah, Is it like E.T.? It's a strong e. film. It's a little like E.T., but you know what? No dialogue even in the first half huh. hour, and it's that good. All right, Dalton Ross. Thank you so much. Thanks, Maggie.